Okay, guys, I'm back here at Weeping Willow. Just threw the majority of my spot mix out. I'm showing you how to go for oversized carp with um, rainy, rainy conditions and, uh, in other words, harsh weather. As you can see, it's raining. I'll show you the mix I use. As soon as I get these in, if it's worth anything. As you can see, that's another good sized cart, but I hate trying to juggle them. I'm trying to stick with this one, in other words. The other one was probably a little bigger, but nonetheless, it's a fairly quick bite for, you know, a rainy day. And anybody that's tried fishing on a rainy day and cloudy weather, uh, most of the time you'll see any videos people are doing this. They're, they're typically fishing on, you know, sunny days and definitely never nights. But uh, a couple of these mixes I've experimented with uh, work fairly well. Again, just kind of following the same process. If you've watched any of my other spotting videos, except for I've just changed the recipe a little bit. But I want to let, let this play out and see uh, see how we do. I'm hoping to get at least one in the 80s, which is extremely well for considering the weather. If you notice, and I'm even out of peak. It's at 6 a.m., so I started throwing the spot mix around 5. By the time I got it all out, it was probably 5 to 20, 25, 30, somewhere in there. But I got a bite fairly quick. Again, you won't be as fast-paced as you would be on a sunny day, but you can still draw them in. I'm actually going to recast this one. Okay, let's see what we got. Again, like I said, I'll be happy with anything in A's. Being guys experience um, weeping willow probably when you first started without spot and it's not much fun at all. But then, like I said, it gets to be a pain when you're trying to learn how to spot and you have to skip through and find the sunny day. And then sometimes you'll skip to the sunny day and for whatever reason the game changes it and it, it's not even sunny it's cloudy but i'm just kind of showing you a cloudy day mix harsh weather mix uh it usually works at night too and again you can play with the numbers a little bit but i'll show you what i put together after this fish and then maybe in part two i'll show you a similar mix at night As you can see, uh, some people may not be impressed by an 80 pound mirror carp. However, this is right in the middle of a rain. Typically speaking, on this map, you won't do quite as well in the rain. But again, that's a nice 80 pounder. My apologies, my phone going off.
Okay, as you can see, um, I just labeled that slow times, but let's see. If you guys watched any of the past videos where I did the advanced mix not too long ago, um, I've swapped out a couple things. One in particular, um, this time I put in Catfish Destroyer and took out the Grand Fish, and I put in 20, fit, uh, 20 ounces instead of Catfish Destroyer, 15 ounces of Big Riverine. I also up this to three ounces of x flavor and giant octopus and the only reason i'm not trying to put in um tutti fruity or any of the uh the, the fruity ones uh sweet sweet crucian csl any of those i've noticed if you can just put three ounces of these in you can still pick them up and i'll also do one thing that's unique um i'll put in seven ounces of the oil cake eight ounces of the hemp corn and then throw in uh, just one ounce and you can also play with that a little bit but I just was curious to see if anybody else has figured this out and I think I have uh, I've been able to get some at, the, at night even at uh, in the 90s so uh, maybe in part two I'll show you guys another mix but uh, just in general you know kind of just read your labels on your on your mixes and uh, you can usually get uh, get a lot better bite rate not quite as like you would on a sunny day, but uh, if you get stuck on a, a peak that you don't want to be on, and whether you're a new level or a higher level and you're just getting here or you've been here for a while, but I thought that was something I wanted to share and pass along to you guys. So uh, hope you guys enjoyed.